Welcome, guys. Welcome, and uh, we're gonna play some Ace of Knaves Joker right now. I still don't know which team to use. Uh, since he is literally like his own class and he's a nomad, I feel like any class is gonna be great for him. So you should definitely uh, suggest me which teams do you think are gonna be the best in the comments. I'm, I'm just gonna play whatever I think is good, but I'm sure you guys are gonna come up with absolutely the best team for Ace of Knaves Joker. For now, let me just find this guy. We need to max him out. I literally just recorded my opening. If you haven't watched it, go watch it. It was epic. I had a very nice workout. I'm still trying to catch my breath. Uh, all right. I like I like having lots and lots of level up cards. I can level up like 50 characters. This is ridiculous and also amazing. By the way, did you know it takes one, basically two million coins to max out a support card from zero to 10. 2 million. I have a lot of coins, so we're just gonna do it. I don't care. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do 10. It's one... You're literally saving 1 million. It, it costs 1 million coins to get it from 10 to 11, but I'm probably gonna drop it at some point, so I might as well save, my, save myself 3 million coins and have a chance to drop it from somewhere. This is literally a support card drop that's gonna, worth you, that's gonna be worth a million. This is ridiculous. All right, got my boy pretty much as strong as possible. Beautiful, we're gonna max out his... So, health recovery, that's the only thing that affects... Oh my god. <laughs> okay. So, Venom deck. Grinning deck and Buzzer deck. Tiny Buzzer, uh, electricity... More and more damage along with draining power. Okay, so Buzzer drains power and damage. This one is uh, Cripple and 50% chance to destroy armor, okay. Intoxicates the opponent, Joker Juice, 50% chance to miss their attacks and take small damage over time. So if you want damage, I think you go for Buzzer deck. If you want uh, if you want them to be blind and take some damage, Venom deck and Grinning deck, if you want to break their gear pretty much. That's that's what I'm, that's how I'm, I'm seeing it. All right, let's put some gear on. Uh, I'm gonna put uh, the, actually the piece that I just got the uh the, the prankster banger <laughs> and i'm gonna give him another unblockable piece because i want this guy to never miss a hit for the rest of the year i'm just gonna give him something basic you know nothing crazy nothing super special i don't want him i don't want him to feel more power powerful than he is and now let's come up with a team i don't even know i don't know what honestly he could work in absolutely any team that's one thing i like about uh ace of knaves joker he he is super versatile, but also it means that he's not great at anything. He's just decent in every team, but he's not... I don't think there is a team that's going to make him shine. Maybe I'm wrong. All right. I decided to go with him, kill Evan Jade and Cabal. Mostly... Oh my god, I didn't I didn't level them up. People are going to tell me, level up your level Fusion X characters. I just maxed out these guys from the previous tower. No, from the tower before the wow I have, I have these guys maxed out for a while and i didn't max out the level i'm i'm so bad I'm, I'm i apologize all right beautiful there's no particular reason why i chose these cards it just seems like uh i want to test out cabal people say cabal, cabal is good again, good again even though i i never thought he like for me he never changed there was a slight speed issue but honestly he was still insane i don't know I guess he is even more insane now. We'll see. Ace of Knaves, Joker. All right. So, fight number one. Let's see how this goes. Gonna try to do all of his special attacks, fatal blow. We're gonna do everything. Everything that we need to do. And hopefully it's gonna look magnificent because it's the Joker. Fight. Come on, boy. Laugh. 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 Uh, we're gonna go for... Let's see if Jade is actually gonna heal from my poison poisoning damage. Also, it's gonna feel ironic. Let's see if you can apply it through the block. That, that's my first test. Oh yeah, it does apply, I think, through the block. Now let's check if it stacks. Ow. You were supposed to be missing me. Okay, can we not die, please? Oh, okay. Thank you, I guess. 
All right, not gonna lie, this didn't start too well. We lost the Joker pretty quickly. Also, I'm gonna make a separate video and I try this guy against the bosses and we see if you can actually do any kind of damage with this guy for like as fusion zero against bosses or any teams in the tower. I'm kind of curious. Maybe, maybe he will be useful as a dot that penetrates uh, dot immunity. Tomorrow the video is coming. Don't spoil it for me. I know you already, I know you already probably know. But I, I wanna I wanna experience it for myself and get disappointed on my own. Thank you very much. What do I want to test now? Let's test the shocker. We're gonna shock this Hanzo. So this is gonna be explosive damage. No 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 shock uh, buzzer deck. Electrical damage and draining power. It doesn't stack. It doesn't stack. Where did poison come from? Oh, that is sick combo ender, my god. Okay, special two. Boom! Boom, boom, right in his balls. Well done, Joker. Oh my god, this is painful. Alright, time to tag. God, Jade is annoying. But now she's on my side, so I'll tolerate it. Excuse me? Alright, for this one, let's break some gear. Grinning deck. Oh. Well, that was disappointing. <laughs> Alright, let's try to get to X-Ray. I kind of want to see his Fatal Blow. It's pretty sick. Uh, let's go for, again, for, for the Grinning deck. I want to see the gear break. Weapon destroyed. Get wrecked, son. Come on, why did I get set on fire? I need my X-ray. Oh, she's gonna snare me. I don't like that. Oh, wait, this is regular Jade. And she's healing? What the hell? Oh, they have that katana. That's what the hell. Okay. Come on, girl. I just want to cripple you. I mean, snare you. Oh, you think you're so smart? Wow, I'm dumb. Wow, I'm dumb. Okay, let's snare her. I, I wanted her to. I wanted her to tag so I can kill her before, before Jay. That that's obvious. Uh, so we're gonna go for poisoning damage, I guess. I still want to test if it applies through the block. All right, let's do. Let's do our X-ray. Fatal blow. Ah. No, Kitana! I wanted to hear his... Why is he not laughing? He should be laughing all throughout this process. That would make it so much better. That would make it so much better, honestly. I'm disappointed. Joker Fatal Blow with no laugh. I'm pretty sure in the original Fatal Blow he has a laugh, right? Uh, let's do this. This is his special one. Just threw a body on her. That's... That's amazing. Not gonna lie, he's... He's fun to play. He has nine cards to use. Nine. I don't see how you can possibly run out of cards throughout the battle. Like, nine is so many. And since they don't stack, there is no reason for you to be applying so, so much. I like it. I don't know, honestly, don't know how viable or useful he is yet. But he's fun to play. That I, I can tell you that. And that's the most important part. Right? Right? Let's fight this Dark Royden. Let's see if we can actually drain power from him. Buzzer deck. No, it actually gives him power. What the hell? That's that's not cool. Boom. Boom. Excellent. Boom, boom. <laughs> now, we have a laugh on special too, but we don't have a freaking laugh on, uh, on X-Ray. Uh, ooh, I get to change it when I run out. That is cool. Uh, let's go for... Let's go for some breaking gear. 
So you cannot use it to interrupt attacks. Which is interesting. Also, in my opinion, destroying weapon? That's basically taking out unblockable chance from your enemies most of the time. Most of the people I feel like use, like in survival, most of the people use weapons as their unblockable pieces. Weapon destroyed, everything destroyed. And he only has 86, wait, I forgot to take a look, I forgot to take a look. If he actually lost, like, health after I destroyed his armor. I mean, not every armor gives health, but it feels like it it, it, it went down. Impressive. Okay, this is good. This is pretty good so far. Battle 5, let's keep dominating. I want to see, I want to, I want to, like, I should probably give him zero unblockable gear if I want to test if cards apply to blocked attacks, but I'm too lazy. So we're going to just have to wait and see. But I, I, I think they do, right? I think they do. That would make sense. He just throws the card. You can't block the card. Cards are too fast to block. Broke gear. Weapon destroyed. What's up, boy? The sound effects are really nice. Oh, weapon destroyed. How sad. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> punch, punch, punch. And it's a grapple, too. Um. Uh, boom. Oh yeah, it does apply. It does apply through the block. That's pretty crazy. This is actually really OP, to be honest. <laughs> Funny. What happened? I didn't pr press pause. I'm just gonna apply all the cards to you. One card. More Joker juice! Enjoy it. It's on me. Okay, okay. I'm changing my mind about this guy. He is a very, very interesting specimen. Very versatile character. He is, like, probably... I'm, I'm, I'm gonna say the most versatile character in the entire game. Like, you can literally make him work with any any team he is nomad he has so many different cards that pretty much can accomplish anything you want it's ridiculous oh i never actually tested armor destroyed what's up boy weapon destroyed what's up boy i never tested if the healing when somebody dies. Let's sacrifice my Cabal. Oh, Brutality! Woo! I forgot I gave get him gear. That was nuts. Okay, can you guys kill my Cabal? Or is he gonna just shred you into pieces? Okay, fine. I'll just stand here. Just do, do your dirty job. I wanna see my Joker heal. Yeah, he is full now. Beautiful. And you can switch decks once you run out. This is such a nice fit. You don't have to tag out and tag back in to do it. Look, I broke his weapon and now he has nothing. Wait, did I break his weapon? I don't remember. Punch him in the nuts, boy. It literally punches him in the nuts. Nice. Nice. I don't know what it is. Fujin, when you have to do his special combo well ender, done. it was driving me crazy, even though it's a few extra steps to receive some effect. Here, though, I'm enjoying putting those. I mean, it doesn't take any extra steps. You do have to select the deck, but at least, like, it, it feels meaningful. Selecting the deck actually feels meaningful compared to Fujin stuff that, like, it's not even that important, to be fair. Oh, God, there's Liu Kang. No, he's gonna wreck my Joker. Wasted try. How unfortunate. Well, maybe he won't be able to kill me. Maybe he's a weak Liu Kang. Maybe he's a weak boy. Uh, is there anything I can do to stop myself from getting stunned? Oh, <gasps> chance to miss. 
Oh, wait, I didn't get stunned, but yet I still got hit in, in my stupid face. Oh, you can't hit me, boy. You can touch this. Whoop, 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 whoop. I don't know why I'm applying why I'm applying so many Joker juices. It actually does decent damage, guys. It actually does decent damage. But again, I don't know if it's because of the fusion boost or is it just that good. We're gonna find out in the next video. For now, we're just gonna get acquainted with this man. And his specialty is so satisfying to do. Like he literally punches him in the nuts. That's amazing. Joker juice. Broken gear. What's up, boy? Another broken gear. Yeah, it does. It definitely works through the block. Literally, right now, I hit him through the block. Oh, how sad. All your gear is broke. You can actually fight using only cards. You don't need to use anything else. Look. Card. Card. And now special... Ah, oh, come on, dude. I almost had him. You just throw cards. But it's kind of wasteful because their effects last for a while. And if you throw another one... You're kind of wasting some of the dot damage. Well done. My god, I had so much fun. Now it's the time to answer the most important question. Was this worth $60 that I spent on this man? Maybe. Maybe. I don't think he's going to be super game-changing or helpful. But he is fun to play. I am I can see myself playing him just for fun and like easier tower battles, some maybe lower towers in Survivor because he's only Fusion Zero. I do not intend to spend any more money to get him to higher Fusion. One Fusion Zero is enough to have some fun with him. So if you guys don't care about progression and if you're just collector or just genuinely enjoy this character, maybe maybe it's worth spending some money for you to just so you can have fun with him but like don't expect him to carry you through towers or stuff like that he is fun but he is not overpowered at least i haven't seen it yet maybe i'll change my mind in my next video and we're gonna take him against some tower battles normal battles boss battles and we're gonna see if he can do anything Ooh, subscribe not to miss it that video is coming tomorrow it's gonna be epic thank you for watching a wonderful day thank you members of the patrons for supporting this channel and have a wonderful day